We're gonna make pizza today. All right, there it comes, there's our dough. So before I try and make this round out on it here, I don't want to stick on there. I'm gonna put a little cornmeal on the bottom here. Oop, that's more than enough. I'm gonna start forming a ball. Well, actually a round. We don't have to be perfectly round. You might have a rolling pin around. Stick. Oh, I should have got some flour. Uh oh. Let's just work it out by hand then. It's probably going to end up being a thick pan, thick pizza. Hey, what if I roll on this side now? We're gaining. Now, I might be Italian, I'm a quarter Italian, but. That doesn't mean I, I'm a pizza round guy. A little more. Shoot. Should have got the flour out. Way too thick over here. There we go. We'll just keep working it. Just keep stretching this out. Oh. You know what? Forget the gloves. That's not working, okay? We're almost there. So keep working this. It's one thing that's always frustrated me working with pizza dough. All right, with a little patience and a little, a little work, you can get yourself your, get your dough round out. It's pretty thick on this side, but that's for the people that like the thick crust. Then we'll have, we'll have thick and thin. And just a little more, a few more pieces on the top. She's smoking in there. Now, the trick is just getting this slid off. If we get that, we got her made. Oh, close. And take a peek. Oh, oh, oh boy, does that look good. There you, look at the little pepperonis being cupped. Take a look at the bottom. Where the cheese slid off there it's stuck see if I can lift this up where you can see it I haven't even seen it Ooh, it's a little brown a little black I mean there oh. oh nothing's gonna fall off there we go got a little charred probably should have pulled it a little couple minutes earlier but let's um try this out yeah, I overdid it just a little, just a few minutes. But, uh, and, and I got a Kettle House Cold Smoke. It's one of the most popular beers here in Western Montana. It's a dark beer, but it's not like regular dark beers. It's kind of sweet and full bodied, smoky. That's where, I guess that's where they come up with this Cold Smoke name. But back to the pizza, let's see. Mm. Even though I overdid the bottom a little bit, it doesn't taste burnt. And uh, it's cooked all the way through. Nice and puffy here. I didn't get a pepperoni on that piece. Let me try a burnt pepperoni. Mm. Mm. That's really good. That's how you make a real pizza when you're out camping. None of that flat bread, phony stuff. I want the real thing. Mm -hmm.